Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over the last couple of weeks, I've been posting some videos regarding the new performance section in the Google Chrome web browser that Google is currently testing in Chrome Canary, which is a preview version. And just a couple of days ago, I posted that the new memory saver option and mode was available um, on the performance page um, in Chrome Canary, which helps to improve the performance of the browser. And now, um, just to keep you updated, um, if we just head to the uh, the settings menu in Chrome Canary and we head over to the new performance section and page over and above the memory saver which I posted on just a couple of days ago we finally now have the battery saver mode um, as I have been mentioning over the last couple of weeks which has now finally become available in my region um, in Chrome Canary now just to do a quick recap um, memory saver and um, when you turn the feature on and toggle it on um, it reclaims memory from tabs that aren't actively being used. So it's a, ve a feature very similar to the sleeping tabs that's currently available in the Microsoft Edge web browser. And then the new battery saver mode um, went on. If you toggle the feature on, um, Chrome conserves battery power by limiting background activity and visual effects such as smooth scrolling and video frame rates. And then you have two options. Turn on when my computer is unplugged and as we can see, turn on when my battery is low. Now just to demonstrate, obviously my battery is fully charged at the moment so I'm going to um, use the feature turn on when my computer is unplugged and as I've been mentioning over the last um, couple of weeks if I unplug my um, laptop from the power source you will see in the uh, top right of the toolbar we get the battery saver mode icon which that is that little like lightning bolt icon and if we click on that it informs you that battery saver is on background activity and some visual effects like smooth scrolling may be limited and you can actually turn the feature off um, from the uh, drop down um, fly out menu or um, if I plug it back in you will see if I plug my laptop back into the power source that obviously disappears because now my, my um, laptop is once again plugged in. So it seems that uh, Google is getting quite serious about the new performance section um, as they have been giving us um, quite a bit of um, attention. And now we have the memory saver plus now the new battery saver mode, which was added in my overnight update to Chrome Canary on both my devices. So it is quite possible that this new performance section with these um, the memory saver and the battery saver mode um, could be rolling out in an up and coming stable version but it's still early days and uh, just to um, uh, remind you that for uh, the performance section and the memory saver and the battery saver mode um, to appear in Chrome Canary you need to have um, a couple of flags enabled so if we just head to chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags the first is if we type in efficiency just go back there by one there we go. If you need to have enable the high efficiency mode feature in these settings, that needs to be toggled on. That's the first flag you need. And then the second flag is if we head back to um, the search and we just go battery, uh, you need to have enable the battery saver mode feature in the settings. That also needs to be enabled. And I think there might be one more. Let me just go high efficiency this time. No, it's exactly the same. So it's just those two flags. Enable high efficiency mode. And then as mentioned, just type in battery. And that's the battery. Uh, the battery saver mode that will need to be enabled as well in settings. So you need those two flags enabled. And then as mentioned, um, in the settings menu performance page, um, you will have um, the new performance uh, section with the memory saver and the battery saver mode that's now included. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.